मोस्ट कॉमनली आस्क क्वेश्चन एज यूजल इज वॉट काइंड ऑफ सैलरी विल आई अर्न वॉट काइंड ऑफ जॉब विल आई गेट वॉट काइंड ऑफ फ्यूचर डू आई हैव इफ आई परस्यू सी एफ ए सो इफ यू आर परस्यूंग ओनली सी एफ ए राइट देर आर मेनी कंपनीज करेंटली विच आर रेडी टू हायर यू एट वेरियस पैकेजेस सो सी एफ ए हैज वन बिग एडवांटेज राइट एज सुन एज यूर डन विद इवन लेवल वन यू कैन डायरेक्टली स्टार्ट वर्किंग इन द फील्ड ऑफ फाइनेंस एंड यूर ऑलरेडी गोइंग टू बी कंपेन्सेटेड मोर देन वॉट जस्ट अ नॉर्मल ग्रेजुएट मेक्स so on an average a simple level 1 starts being paid anywhere between 4 to 5 lakhs i have heard that in companies such as anand rati level 2 students are also paid 8 to 10 lakhs and if you are level 3 the sky is the limit plus you combine your cfa with let's say an mba and you become an unstoppable force that's when getting into careers such as hedge funds or investment banking the thing we spoke about at the beginning that becomes a possibility And that being said, what kind of profiles can you get hired into? CFAs get hired into things such as portfolio manager. They basically do something known as equity research. So you just sit and analyze all the companies that are listed and trading in the market. As usual, maybe I'm repeating it again, but investment banking and hedge funds again is something which becomes a career path. And when it comes to what kind of companies hire CFAs, you can. If I look at Indian companies, companies such as Muti Lal Oswal. Anand Rati, ICICI Securities, these Kotak Mahindra Securities, these are the Indian companies that I hire. And when it comes to international MNCs, besides the big four companies such as JP Morgan, Morgan Stanley, Goldman Sachs, all these kind of companies hire CFAs. And this is just for India. You can take this qualification and travel across the world, and you will have opportunities anywhere in the field of finance.